I want to um, talk a little bit about how the Glazy 601 compares to linseed oil putties. Basically, linseed oil putties have been around forever. It's been used for at least 400 years. And linseed oil putties are basically linseed oil and chalk for calcium carbonate. As the linseed oil putty dries, it off gases, and it's going to leave behind a rock hard mass of caulk. This mass has poor adhesive strength and allows moisture to penetrate. This hard mass also cracks during expansion and contraction of the wood and glass. And yes, even the glass moves a little bit. And I'm going to show you that. This is a perfect example of what happens. Eventually, this is going to continue to crack, dry, shrink, pull away from the glass, and you're going to get moisture penetration and deterioration of your wood substrate. Okay, first of all, step one is we're going to clean this off. I'm just going to clean off the surface dirt so that we're going to have good adhesion from the Glazia 601. This is called retooling. Instead of completely taking this window sash out, cutting out the old linseed oil putty, we're going to tool over it and reseal it with the glazes. This window sash we're doing in place. Now that we've run our bead down the first side of the sash, we're going to take our glazes applicator tool. Hold it so that the flat side is down. And pull up at the corner. For the second run on our sash, so that we're not wasting material, I'm going to take our wide angle palette knife and I'm going to apply the excess glazes up the second side of the sash. Glazy 601 um, cleanup. You don't have to use a razor blade. Actually, it comes off very easy with the putty knife. Very easy on the glass, very sympathetic. You're not going to scratch it. So basically, after your glazes is dried, just follow the line down with a putty knife and wash the sash like you normally would cleaned up the excess off the glass, all you have to do is use a little glass cleaner and go over it. And there we have it. Retooled glazing compound. It's going to save your window sash for quite a few more years. <laughs>